In 2011, several city leaders got together to figure out what the people in the community would want here. If it could be anything, what would be the best thing? There was a resounding number one, and that was a hospital. And today, that number one best thing is officially coming to the old sleep train arena in Natomas. But I think that's great. I mean, the building's just sitting there doing nothing. The Sacramento Kings and California North State University reached a deal to build a hospital, trauma center, and medical school that's expected to bring thousands of jobs to the area. The university released these renderings of what the complex would look like. Another health care campus for the city of Sacramento. Thousands of high wage jobs, innovation center. I know that the hospital and, and, and the teaching facility, that's just going to be the beginning of this. Yeah, it's promising, you know, the construction jobs and everything that that kind of stuff brings. Hospital, 3,000 jobs, they're not going to be low paying jobs. They're probably going to be very good paying jobs. So that's fantastic. Some people who live in the area say it's about time. A hospital here would cut down on the longer drive to downtown Sacramento and potentially save lives. When you have any emergency, 911 take us to downtown or anywhere. So it's hard for the family because of that crucial time. So it's really very nice to hear that that they are finally opening a hospital in this community. The King's owner is saying finding the right partner with the right project was crucial. We wanted to do something that would establish our goal, which is to make this the area of the future, the city of the future, the mega region of the future. Uh, anytime there's a place for university students to train and uh, bring more medical uh, uh, help to the area is just amazing. That's great for the uh, local uh, economy, great for Sacramento, great for the taxes, and hopefully they can build more infrastructure around here. In the Thomas, Walter McCullough, KCRA 3 News. Now the Kings donated the 35 acre property. Officials say that the project could get underway as early as this year with the demolition of the arena.